Fingering a woman feels horrible to her. Stop fingering a woman and do something different instead. Let me explain to you about that today. I'm Alexi Walsh. I've been working with women for the last 20 years as a sex coach and a sex therapist. And uh, what I'm telling you here has come from uh, listening to a lot of women about their experience of having fingers inside the vagina. A lot of guys look for tips how to finger a woman. And let me tell you, half of the women I have spoken to in my life, uh, they find it painful to hear the word fingering. It creates uh, this kind of off-putting reaction to them, uh, the whole idea of being fingered. And that's because the word being fingered uh, also depicts an action of being fingered. So, you know, you're sticking the finger inside her vagina and then you start going at it. You start digging into her vagina because somebody somewhere on YouTube told you that you need to be really stimulating that spot really kind of strongly to try to make her come. So a lot of guys do exactly that. They put the finger in and they start digging at it. They start going at it. And uh, let me tell you, few things in sex feel more horrible to a woman than that. That is the truth. For a woman, the vagina is a very uh, sensitive, soft, sensual place. It's a vulnerable space. It can often hurt and when it doesn't hurt uh, it's really inside her and she wants it to be treated really delicately so when you go in and you start doing that that does not feel nice uh, you're not going to give her a lot of pleasure you're probably going to make her hurt and you're definitely not going to make her come like this because she's not going to be relaxed uh, and uh, she's not going to be sensitive there if you're going to use the fingers inside the vagina you need to change mentally how you see it you must stop calling it fingering you have to start calling it touching the vagina inside. You are touching the woman inside. You are loving her inside. You are caressing her inside. You are speaking to her inside with your finger. You are interacting with her inside. You are not just stimulating her and working her. Do you see the difference? This will make all the difference. It will make the vagina open to you. It will make her feel a lot more. It will make her uh, relax. It will uh, allow her to enjoy it. So what do you do instead? First of all, it's really important that you go in uh, quite carefully and gently. Don't just stick it in. Uh, don't keep your finger really firm because that initial uh, kind of going in uh, is potentially a big shock for her uh, when it's too aggressive. It's really important to go in really gently. So uh, you just wiggle your way in. You find the opening and you just really gently go in very softly with a soft finger. Don't, don't keep your finger rigid. Uh, Kind of wiggle your way in gradually like this slowly you need a lot of lubrication either she's already really wet or if she's not really wet you use a lubricant you use saliva uh, do not be misled by a little bit of wetness around because it might not be enough for the whole finger to go in if she's not comfortable when you go in and it creates friction there's not enough lubrication you have ruined it already it's going to burn and after that applying more lubrication is not going to help because she is already in pain so you can only prevent it you can't fix it later you can only prevent it by having enough lubrication before be safe make sure there is a lot of lubrication make your finger wet and also by god we do not ever start with two fingers no matter how aroused the woman is we always start with one finger go watch a video that i have specifically on that why that is so important uh, the video is called using one finger or two once you have gone inside gently and slowly don't start moving yet just relax for a minute or two because uh, that gives you that uh, a bit of time to stop being so tense about what's going to happen now you're going to keep hammering or you know working it and she can just relax she can start trusting you she can start feeling in uh, it's really important for her that initial connection be there be really with her just really uh, connect with her without any movement it will go a long way trust me and then you start interacting you start speaking with her you start interacting not working not stimulating just interacting touching her touching her in different places that I've showed you in other videos, on the G spot, on the A spot, around the opening. So you're just interacting, first of all, gently with gentle movements. You are speaking to her. It's a conversation. Think about it like you are loving her. You're loving the softness inside her. So you're just gently exploring it. The slower you start, the more she will feel. Uh, the more you start doing straight away, the more numb she will get. You will shut down the feelings. In fact, the next really nice thing to do would be to gently stimulate the A spot at the back while you're still inside there. That's a really good next thing to do. And you can start it gently. That would be a, a really good place in that progression. So I have a whole video on stimulating the A spot. You should go and watch it. Then you need to have a sense of progressiveness. You are building up little by little. The movement become a bit uh, bigger or they become a bit firmer. But this happens gradually. And later you might start with bigger movements, with longer movements through the A spot, through the G spot, like I showed you in the videos on the A spot and the G spot. Go watch them. But it is still loving stroking. You're still really present. You are really 
really loving her, you're really caressing her, you're speaking with her. So interact with the vagina, converse with the vagina, love the vagina, don't finger it. That mental and emotional intention will do everything. It will give her a much better experience. That said, please remember that women have been fingered so badly, so much, that uh, I've met a lot of women who simply do not enjoy fingers inside the vagina, even if you do it well. They just don't feel it. They don't connect with it. it, it just, it's just not a thing for them. So don't buy into the hype that you see everywhere online, that women absolutely love being fingered. Some women do, and some women just don't. If they're going to have anything inside, they would prefer for it to be a penis in the heterosexual sex. They just feel it better, they don't really connect with the finger, so don't expect every woman to enjoy it. If she doesn't, don't force her, uh, do other things, do things with her body, give her oral sex, and have intercourse. And actually on that subject, to explore the richness of vagina, I recommend you to watch my video on the four types of vaginal orgasms that women can have in the vagina so that you understand more how it all works. Go and watch it now. If this is useful, guys, please like this video and subscribe. It really uh, supports my channel.